Hello everyone, welcome to another video of TT Passion. My name is Vincent and today in this video, I'm going to share with you my review of the Fan Chen Tong ALC. So this is the new blade that uh, Fan Chen Tong is now using. I think the only exception that what we can get in the market now is that uh, the butterfly label at the bottom is actually in silver color. But if you have saw uh, the blade that Fan Chen Tong is using, uh, it is the Fan Chen Tong ALC. However, his personal blade comes with the gold label butterfly logo. Okay, so uh, there are some rumors that this may be available in the market in future. So I think that's something that we just have to wait and see if it will ever be released for the public to purchase. Okay, so in this review, the forehand rubber I'm using is actually Dignix 80 and for backhand, it is Dignix 09C. So these are the two rubbers that I have been using more frequently uh, recently and I really find that they are uh, really amazing and I'm slowly getting used to the rubber. And uh, these are probably the rubber combination that I'll be using moving forward for most of my uh, blade reviews. Alright, so the Fan Zhen Tong ALC blade that I have here is actually about 89 grams uh, before having any rubber being placed onto it. And with the two rubbers that I have here, it now weighs about 187 grams. So the, the rubbers that would mean is about uh, 98 grams or so for two sides. Okay, so this is the setup that I will be reviewing in this video. So in this review, I will share with you some of the snapshots I have recorded during my practice so you can actually see how the blade performs. Uh, what I will cover in the review basically will be the control of this blade, uh, the power or the speed of this blade, and also the trajectory. Okay, so those are the three main areas that I will look at when I review this blade. And uh, towards the end of the video, I will share with you my thoughts on this blade itself, whether is it worth buying or not. So let's get started. Let's start with the control ability of this Fan Zhen Tong ALC over here. Personally, I would rate the control uh, with a very high rating. Uh, if we were to look at 5 star, I will actually give it a 4.5 star. Okay, This is simply because the blade itself is rather soft. Uh, the ball does not bounce off the blade immediately. There is actually some downtime in terms of handling the ball. So when you are practicing... So when you are doing your service game um, i feel that in terms of service i can actually control the ball really well it is very consistent in terms of the service and it is able to land to the area that i want creating the spins that i want okay uh, easily secondly in terms of handling sharp ball this bed is excellent as well because it does not create that bouncing off effect when the ball strikes your blade. It is easy to handle the short ball without returning it too high or towards uh, an area that you do not want to. The next thing about the control of this blade is the offense and defense ability. For the offense ability, I will say that this blade is excellent. For the offense ability of this blade, it is really great because it, it produces really consistent shots that does not surprise you. And this is also the same for the defense ability of this blade. Hence, overall, I will actually give a 4.5 star rating out of 5 for the control of this Fan Zhen Tong ALC. Next, let's take a look at the power and speed of this blade. So, for power and speed, I will look at two areas in terms of striking the ball really power, uh, really hard closer to the table and far away from the table. For the Fan Zhen Tong ALC, I will say that the blade is stronger when it is playing when you are playing closer to the table compared to far away from the table. For Viscaria, uh, it is the same as well in terms of what I think about Viscaria. However, the Fan Zhen Tong ALC has a slightly thicker core which is 0.1 mm more and this allows a better uh, gameplay when you are further away at the back of the table as well. So this is definitely an improvement as compared to Vistara. However, I do still feel that this blade is more powerful when you play close to the table. So if you like to play close to the table, this blade is really excellent for you. And it is really fast and powerful 
with that excellent control that I mentioned earlier on. So this blade is a well-balanced blade, I will say. And lastly, if we were to look at the trajectory, I will actually give it a rating of 4 out of 5 as well. The reason being, the control of this blade is so good that it allows you to create the trajectory you want. Be it whether you are trying to load the ball higher and more spinny to create uh, surprises for your opponent, or are you going for all-out pure attack mode whereby you want to hit it long and fast and low. Okay, so the thing about this blade here is that the trajectory is easy for you to control and that is why I will give it a rating of 4 out of 5 and you are able to generate the kind of trajectory you want. So for me, after a few sessions of testing, I was able to create the low trajectory shots that I always like to go for and this is something really pleasant for me as a player. Now, let me share with you my overall thoughts of this blade over here. So what impressed me most about the blade over here is the control ability of this blade. The control is at a 4.5 rating for me, so which means that it actually allows me to do a lot of things with this blade that uh, I want to produce. So that is really important and I think that gives me a lot of confidence in terms of using this blade as well. So the control ability of this blade is something that really impressed me. So if you are someone that loves the blade that gives you a lot of control, I think the Fanzhenong ALC is an excellent choice. So the price of this blade now is about 220 Singapore dollars at the time of this filming. And I think uh, if you are looking for something that is of excellent control and power, you can actually consider the Fanzhenong ALC. Uh, in terms of whether $220 is a worthwhile investment for a blade like this, uh, I will say definitely yes. Uh, so if you are looking for something similar to Viscaria, but you want something new and a little bit more powerful, I think the Fan Zhen Tong ALC will be an excellent choice for you. So that sums up my thoughts of the Fan Zhen Tong ALC over here. If you have any questions about the Fan Zhen Tong ALC, do share in the comment section. I will be happy to answer them for you. And for those who have tested the Fan Tong ALC as well, I definitely welcome you to share your views as well, what are your thoughts of the blade, so we can all benefit from the experience that you have. I've come towards the end of this video and I hope that this video has provided you with some valuable insights and is beneficial to you. So remember to like and share this video and subscribe to TT Passion for more awesome table tennis video content. See you in the next video. Bye bye!